How important is family mealtime? Do you get a chance to sit down with your own family regularly for meals? And what might be the benefits of having meals with your family? Hey guys, my name is Didi and I'm an Irish-based registered dietitian, health writer and vlogger with DDTitian.com. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to my channel and follow my page to get little updates about when my evidence-based nutrition videos come out next. Now research shows that less than a quarter of families actually have regular family meals together. Yet the importance of family mealtimes is not to be overlooked. Today I will be talking to you about some of the many wonderful benefits of sharing regular family meals. While I will mostly talk through the research that is done on having meals with your family, the benefits of simply sharing meals with others, be it friends or housemates, is likely to have some similar effects as well. So family meals are on the decline. Research has shown that over the past 40 years, our lives have become overscheduled and family meals have become undervalued. One third of people feel that their family is often too busy to eat dinner together. The pressures of busy working and after school lives have left us feeling stressed and tired. But did you know that study after study is showing the psychological benefits that regular family meals can have on our mental health and that of our children? What are the psychological benefits of having regular family meals? Well, families who have frequent meals together often report lower rates of depression and have better family relationships. Regular family meals show an even stronger link to getting high grades in school than doing homework. And teenagers who eat family meals on five to seven nights a week are twice as likely to get A's in school as those who eat dinners with their families on less than one night a week. And not only that, but teenagers who regularly sit down with their families for a meal show less risk-taking behaviors such as smoking, using drugs and fighting. They have a 35% reduced risk of developing eating disorders and have a better self-esteem. What are the benefits to our weights of having regular family meals then? Family meals are not just great for our minds, they are also fantastic ways to improve our diets. Families who eat more regular family meals together have overall healthier diets. They eat more vegetables, fruits, healthy grains and calcium rich foods. And meanwhile they drink less sugary drinks and eat less high fat foods. And these effects don't just stay at the dinner table with the family. Young adults who had regular family meals as teenagers are now continuing to eat more vegetables, more fiber and more vitamins and minerals, and they are 20% less likely to regularly eat fast food. Remarkably, they also try to sit down with their own friends and young families more often, putting a greater effort into encouraging family meals of their own. Now, these fantastic benefits of family meals on the quality of our diets can also be seen in our weights. One in four of our children in Ireland is overweight or obese, and this number only grows when we reach adulthood. Interestingly, the odds of being overweight are significantly lower in studies for people who reported eating family dinners almost every day. Studies show that the more often a family sits together for a meal, the less likely all family members are to be overweight or obese. By sharing three meals a week with your family, the risk of being overweight in these studies is reduced by 12%. Now, I challenge you to sit down with your family or your friends for a meal on one more day than usual this week. While getting the gang together for a meal may be tough and food may not all get eaten and the conversation may not flow as wonderfully as it does in those Christmas movies, family meals, like everything, takes practice. In my next video, I'm going to delve a little deeper into what makes family meals so valuable. What aspects of this magical meal can bring such fantastic benefits? And what do we need to think about when preparing our own family meals? I hope you found this video useful. Feel free to comment below with any questions at all. And if you like this video, please let me know down there with a little thumbs up or a little heart and potentially a positive comment as well. For more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel and click that little bell button on my channel page to get notified when my next video comes out. Thanks so much for watching guys and all going well. I'll be back to see you in two weeks time. Bye.